7,000 cities across the world are dimming their lights for this year's Earth Hour, kicking off in Asia, skylines from Shanghai to Hong Kong to Singapore went dark at 8.30 local time. By doing activities like switching off the lights or turning it all off, it gives you a time to introspect, basically to understand where we've been so far, what should be done, how much more should be done. Maybe it is a right step towards awareness. What began as a one-off event in Australia 15 years ago is now marked in 154 countries, with the world's most iconic monuments plunged into darkness to help raise awareness about climate change and the environment. This year, Earth Hour is highlighting the link between the destruction of nature and the increasing incidence of diseases such as COVID making the leap from animals to humans. As Europe's most iconic landmarks went dark, including the Eiffel Tower in Paris, the Colosseum in Rome and Moscow's Red Square, a giant panda, the mascot of the World Wildlife Fund, was on hand to flick the switch at Berlin's Brandenburg Gate. With large gatherings ruled out for this year's event, people were instead asked to follow the action online and to start looking at the planet in a new light.